Good afternoon and welcome. We're going out. I'll get. I'll take the camera off him. He's fixing on his. No, you're looking at your phone. I'm looking for the place to we're go. Out, we're out in nature, and you're looking at your electronic device. <laughs> Hate that. Right, Hate I'll that. Just, I'll just guess the direction, <laughs> shall I? It's about 300 metres away. Oh, then. Well, you can show us where to get there, can't you? I'll, I'll turn Tom Tom off, and we'll go by Dan Dan. <laughs> we are going to a deer park. Basically, it's like an estate with a very, very posh looking country pub. Obviously, um, it's a bit posh, aren't we? We were all worried about what we're wearing. <laughs> and then we saw JP. <laughs> we're not bothered anymore. No, I don't care, I always dress like compo. <laughs> Um, so yeah, we're hoping to see a deer. I don't think we will through the day. Yes, we will. Unless the very tame deer and they're just in field. I don't know. They'll be there. Trust me. Um, and maybe stop off in the pub. We'll see. Well, we will. Maybe. You liar. But it looks very, very posh. So we don't think we're going to eat in there. It could be very expensive. It's got an a la carte menu. Yeah. And what did we read earlier? It said. Um, on Sundays we don't have the reindeer hog fire going or something like that. It we looks really cook, We posh. don't cook on the open fire with the moose antlers above it. That's what it's, it's yeah, like on that, a Sunday. Like, but hey. the bar mills look cheap, cheap enough. We'll see, we'll see. <laughs> but this has interested us. It, on our, yesterday's video, this is where we, I thought we were heading down to. We did end down at him, has it? No, we did. And then we walked straight back because he took us we didn't wrong come way. Down this we didn't bit. Come down we here. got to here and we turned no, we back. We did it. What did you hear him? So we're going straight we into the country estate entrance. No, we're not. No, we're not. We're going round the corner. No access to Gunton Arms. Please use Fort Market entrance. That looks very Gunton Arms, that's the yes. posh pub. Look at that. Private. Gate. Sawmill gate only. It's beautiful round right here, isn't it? It is beautiful, but don't you think we're a little words, bit uh, common? What? We're a bit common for round here. Speak for yourself, Speak for mate. yourself, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I'm filming this for absolutely no reason because you can't see it. Right over there in the distance is a massive stag with massive antlers. There's, There's two over there as well, as well babe. Under the tree. And there's some over there, and they're just grazing, sitting, enjoying, and being very endearing. Oh dear. Oh dear. So this is towards Gunter Arms or Gunther Arms, we're Gunton. not sure. Gunton. Gunton. Gunton Arms, and there's all these big, massive stone things. Car park left. that way. I think it's left. I this is the deer park, I think. Car park for oh. the deer park. It's a posh place. Lovely, isn't it? Oh, there's some common Your cars in here, is though. On the left. It's alright, common cars, so you might get away with it looking like that. So I'm just getting out of JP's car and this is what you've got to love about JP and Sammy. I think this is more Sammy because this is in the passenger side. You don't get this in most uh, glove compartment bits. Look at that. Look at that. It's a purse. What do they call them? Mermaid's purse. Mermaid's purse. Absolutely beautiful. That is from a sh uh, dogfish. He reckons shark, it's not, it's a dogfish, it's a dogfish seed pod. That is beautiful. So we've just pulled up, the car is here, and right behind us is a family, an extended family of ink cap mushrooms. I've been mentioning these quite a bit lately. Now, I tried to say in the video the other day about why they're called ink caps in their later stages they start to uh, can i get in there i'll try and give you a better angle uh, 
see how it's curling up at the bottom there it tends to do that later in its stage that's a young one it will eventually turn like this and if you see this look see the ink on my finger they literally drip what looks like ink and that is why they are called ink cap mushrooms thank me later well, this is an unusual way to get to the pub, isn't it? Car park there. <laughs> it's a beautiful sign, isn't it? Arms. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know what's up here. I don't know if it's like deer or something. Just the pub, is it? Oh, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you, Sammy, my dear. Look at that. <laughs> What do you reckon, babe? Right, wow. Susan, you're not going to get trained by a great big stag, do you? What do you reckon, honey? Uh, it's not right, yeah. It's nice. What's this look? Ooh. The art. A looks a uh, worm now seed. Warm. A box of worm seed. At best, a statutory of green mummy. What? What's this flesh? A little. You're rubbish at this. A little. At least I've got you right. Crud, uh, it properly. A little. Thou art a box of worm seed at the best, but a salutary of green mummy. What's this flesh? A little. crudded milk. Fantastical. That is just junk. What's that all about? I'm not reading the rest. It's boring. Puff. Paste. Our bodies are weaker than those paper prisons boys used to keep flies in. Forget it! Forget it. It's boring. <laughs> Pine. <laughs> Looks like. Yeah, you come. So much like. Stop You're interrupting right. him. Let him talk. No, if time. it weren't for JP, no, you said, said this is obviously a medieval deer park. It's not. What it's not. It? The pub was only born in the 1800s, right, so after medieval. Boring, boring. Should we let him get on with it? Yeah, come on, Sammy. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You know what they're doing? Making an excuse not to get up to the bar, aren't they, and pay? I haven't got my phone or anything. I ain't got nothing either. No. no. So there we go, the Gunton Arms. What a beautiful building. Right, what to expect? What to expect? Fear. Right, okay, so we were initially through there. We're now sitting here in the comfy little area. Me and Sammy's on this lovely, um, what would you call this so far? What do they call Chesterfield. these? Ch Chesterfield, that's the one I'm looking for, yes. <laughs> so Dan's going up for a second round of drinks. Look at JP in that chair, it makes him look tiny, don't it? <laughs> Bless him. So, yeah. Yeah, it's well warm. But, but those Chesterfields do last forever, yeah, don't they? My dad's got one of these in his conservatory. Oh, has he? He's always sitting in here. Yeah. They just get better with age, don't they? Yeah. And, yeah, you can recover them, obviously, as well. They're worth recovering because yeah. they don't build them like DFS anymore. Yeah. Right, so anyway, we're just going to show you a quick glance. Sure yeah, that's how they made it, isn't it? Feel it. Feel it like oh, yeah. yeah, you can actually feel it in there yeah. as well. Yeah. So dogs are actually welcome here, as long as it's not in the food area courty bit. Court, it's not a court. Restaurant. Restaurant. They've got loads of different rooms in here. It's amazing. I just wouldn't even know where to begin. Uh, Dan reckons the men's toilets are a little bit interesting. <laughs> Say no more. Right, uh, so this is the menu. We're still debating whether to get anything, but we probably won't. It's always nice to look at the menu. Well, that's what I was thinking. We could get Bari snackies, couldn't we? Can nibble at them like this says spicy wild boar sausages with chili jam. That sounds really nice. And how do you say that one? Black bly, bly for a crackling, pork crackling with apple sauce. That sounds really nice as well. Um, yeah. 
whole menu looks good. What's on that menu, Sammy? Anything I'm, I'm missing out? Sea trout fillet with seashore vegetables. Yes. Yeah, oh, it is seashore. It is seashore. Oh. Sea kale and stuff like that. Yeah. That Seaweed. <laughs> slew corn. What is slew corn? I always remember my mother. Slew corn. Wasn't that a sea? Slew corn. Might have been a local nun. Was that in Ireland? Yeah. I'm sure it was like a seaweed or something. Oh, what's it called? Come back to you, I remember. Come back to you, yeah. Anyone let me know in the comments if JP don't. <laughs> so, yep. Yeah, even get free water there, look, as well. But, yeah, they do from the elk room fire which was through there and these massive elk they're not horns are they they're antlers aren't they yeah, yeah. i might get down to do a walk through but i doubt he will thank you darling so that's on the menu on that one but those are quite expensive although i'm guessing they're going to be really really nice Sandfire. Sandfire, is that what it is? Sandfire. It might be sandfire. sandfire, you have that with fish. Oh, it's I don't like know. A, it's like a crunchy vegetable you have with fish, Sandfire. Get, where are we going next? Yeah. They sell it around the area, collect it. We'll go and get some and we can try. Okay. You fry it in butter. I don't know, I think I always remember my mother boiling it and it was yeah. really salty. Yes, and... it's probably Sandfire. You reckon it was? Um, Maybe sleep. It looked like little, like little tiny fingers. I can't remember. I was little. I just remember her cooking it up now and again and having a pot full of it steaming in the kitchen. Right, well, thank you, darling. Do you want to take these guys for a walk round? Who? These. These guys. <laughs> JP, you cheated. You're not supposed to try yet. <laughs> right, so we've actually got some little nibbles to try I'm gonna split this amongst us all we've got curry and chips what's this jp again it's venison yeah. sausage roll the most expensive go. portion of sausage roll in the world <laughs> <laughs> that's what they were cutting on the end of the bar earlier and we've got pork, pork crackling pork with crackling. apple sauce venison sausages and yeah, a well, chili well dip a oh, well ball well ball yep yeah. right should we give them a go you up for it <laughs> Should we ask for some little plates? <laughs> yeah, we can do. Mm. So, what do you think then, babe? We're gonna try <laughs> a little plate. Uh, yeah, we've got loads of food. Mm. Right, so we're gonna try these various foods. Now I've just tried a sausage in the jammy oh, yeah. stuff. What is it? Is it jam or chutney or what? Chili jam. Chili, chili jam? jam. Yeah, I'd, I'd, yeah. Mm. It's a very, very thick chili jam. That's nice. It's beautiful, beautiful. Mm. Very tasty sausage. I've not tried anything else yet. Let's go in for a chip and mm. uh, curry sauce. It's basically chips and gray, uh, curry, curry sauce, sauce from a fish and chip shop, but a really good fish and chip shop. It's really nice. Let's see Maz's reaction. Did I sum it up pretty well? Yeah, it's like a post Better than a chip shop. <laughs> Who's going to try it? Well, I'll tell you what, let's turn the camera off and just enjoy his food. It's not to do with you. Right, well that was really yummy. We've actually done a lot of it, which was amazing. Dan's about to drink curry sauce. Can I have it now? Yeah, go on. Can't believe you drank all that curry sauce. Can't believe you've done all that, I know. You actually managed all that. Can't, can't believe can't you managed all that. Well, if you'd have been quicker with beer, I wouldn't have had to drink this, would I? <laughs> <laughs> so it was actually nice to try these yeah, starters nice today, start. wasn't it? That um, was all bit beautiful. Of cracking. Oh! <laughs> Mazza. <laughs> <laughs> I had the last bit of 
So I'll see you through the window. Oh, you winding me up. <laughs> so we did finish it all. It was nice to try the stars because in a couple of days we're actually going to come back and try the meals, aren't we? The proper meals. Lovely, lovely, lovely it is video. absolutely what, really nice. You should actually do that as a platter. Yeah. A bit of everything. Yeah, that was platter. beautiful. I can tell you what though, after That's that, enough. I feel done. No, Do you? No, I, <laughs> no. <laughs> I ain't gonna eat much I'll later now. <laughs> Do you feel done after that? Done. Yeah, that was enough, wasn't it? Oh, I'm starving. Oh, right. Which was your favourite, my darling? Yeah, that's really yeah, nice. Yeah, thank nice. you very yeah. much. My favourite was <laughs> probably <laughs> the sausages. The sausages was the best. Did you like the sausages, did you? The sausages were nice. Oh, wow. The horseradish was lovely. I think that's a curry sauce was everything was lovely. The venison sausage roll, everything was beautiful. What was your favourite? My favourite was... And my mum's favourite flowers. Yeah, me too. My worst. I'm going to ask JP in a minute, but he's busy talking. JP, what was your favourite out of all them things we've just eaten? Oh, my favourite, I think, was close, very closely between the wild boar sausages with the chilli jam. That was absolutely lovely, but I do like the crackling. But I think the wild boar sausages were the best, I think. Sammy, what was your favourite no, out of everything? This. We've done this. We've All right, done... can I turn it off now? It just left in that no one, nobody liked the chips and curry. That's a lie, because I said <laughs> I loved the curry sauce. No, we did like them. We just the chips weren't favorite. special, but the curry sauce was beautiful. In fact, I drunk it. I drunk <laughs> the curry sauce. It was beautiful. <laughs> anyway. Drunk all the curry sauce on my head. That's been I did. There, isn't it? We it's will be leaving nice. this establishment very shortly. I just want to we take... will arrive again yeah. for a meal, proper meal. For a proper meal, but uh, for now, let's get back to no. the common. I'm going to take a little walk around here because it's empty down there. Right. Okay. So we're going to start here. This is the entrance in. Yeah, so, fine. Lovely, thank you. This is our little sit down. What are you talking about? Yeah, Christmas. You imagine here, Christmas. We've got a real open fire. So down here, haven't been down here. If I'm totally honest. <laughs> uh, office there. Oh, little room in there. People are eating, so I don't want to intrude. Hey, pretty girl, don't die now. You're too. Wow. Okay. That's a weird picture, isn't it? You two have been beautiful, okay. So I'm going to take you through here. So we've got like a locked up wine cellar, which is beautiful. Cabinet. This picture can't be real. This is LCD screen, surely. Yeah, the river's moving. I never noticed that. Well, that's interesting. So we do have some weird pictures going on in here. Body parts. Some watchiness as well, which totally doesn't fit in with the place, but it's okay. <laughs> and then we've got these lovely pictures here, look. So this, you're going through an archway. That's the men's toilets, that's the women's, which to me, this feels like you're going into cells down here. I'm not gonna take you into the toilets. Don't wanna intrude on people's business. And I don't really know what's through there, the kitchen area. And then this is the dining area through there. So I don't want to intrude on people in there either. <laughs> but the place is massive. I've not even touched it yet. So we have just come back from a lovely, lovely afternoon. And on the way back, I said, just pull up at reception because that's where you get the goat food. You can buy the goat food. 50 pence. <laughs> I said, let me have four lots. And she says, when are you going to feed them? I says, probably tomorrow. She says, well, I can only let you have so much per day. And I can only give you the food for today, not for tomorrow. 
which is understandable because they can only eat so much per day. So I've got four lots of goat food. I spilled half of mine down there. Yes. What's pumpkin now? I don't know what that's all about. But the goats are but absolutely loving it. Loving it. And loving Sammy's, it. Sammy's kind of getting attacked here, look. But whilst I was in the shop, there was something on the counter. She was out there, she was basically weighing it into bags. And there was something on the counter, it said dried sprats, which is like a fish, I think. Film them, they don't want to see you, they want to see the goat. And I thought, I'll get some of them for JP to eat. Dry sprats, see if he'll eat them, see if he'll like them. And she says, oh no, they're dog treats. So I nearly got them anyway. <laughs> but no, I didn't get them. But yeah, look at these beautiful babies. Oh, yeah. oh. oh what you do? Oh. Do, I, do I have to cut that out? I thought they were going to just eat out anything, of the bag. Goats, really, anything. Good boot for morning. It's a lovely morning, isn't it? Oh, you can hear him sneezing in the background. Do you know that man that doesn't ever get ill because he blows his brains out every day? Good morning, honey. I'm poor. Somebody's a little poorly. Poorly. I don't think you've caught anything as such. I just think it's you being out in the wet and rain and wet clothes. It would do. One wanted when we went for the walk and I got sore. <sighs> yeah, your jeans and everything were wet and you. So I was yeah. shaking. I were a bit cold yesterday, weren't I? To the yeah. bone type cold. Yeah. And I woke up this morning with a very sore throat and. And nose. even before we went to the pub yesterday, you weren't sort of top notch, was you? I'm all right. It's poorly. JP's given him look, this lovely. I don't know if you're lending it to you or. I think he said I can have it. Oh, did he? Here. Wow, that's well smart. Look at all the pockets on that babe. It smells of him. Oh, your best friend. That's very comfy. So yeah, he's given him this to keep him lovely and warm and snug. Oh, that's cool. I look like a teddy bear. You look like JP. <laughs> So what we're doing this morning, we're not doing a lot, are we? Um, well, rain has just started and it's yes. not to be here till about three o'clock, so... Yeah, it's not a good start to the day. I don't know. Um, just editing and watching our vlog, actually, at the moment, aren't we? And JP's cooking for us tonight. He's making a nice, warm, poorly person's chicken stewy broth to make me feel soup. better. It's a soup. Chicken broth soup. I think is what he said, or did he say stew? Broth. A broth. Chicken broth. Which oh. is a stew -y kind of soup. Oh, I hope I don't get it. Well, come sit next to me. Why well, don't you want any? No, I, you. I mean, past. You just as I hope I don't get it. He's making that for us. No, getting what you've got. Chicken broth? <laughs> no, you're cold. Oh, yes, I'm cold. <laughs> So just a quick couple of things. Now this is referring to the Mazzy X channel, but because we're not filming on there at the moment, um, I'm gonna say on here and just hope that David's actually watching. I've got your parcel all packed, ready to go, but you just have to please bear with me to um, get to a post office. You haven't left to go to one yet. You all right? Paul. Oh, <laughs> doesn't he look nice in your jumper? Yeah, he's looking at that. He can have it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I've got another one at home, same. Have you? He, he put it on and he goes, oh, it smells like JP. <laughs> <laughs> he, oh. he did, you did. He keeps you all cosy and warm. <laughs> <laughs> See you in a bit. <coughs> bye, bye. Right, second thing I want to show you is my new jacket. Now, this arrived just before we'd left. Still in two minds about it, and Dan's like, "Oh, just wear it, just wear it." What's some advice? So I bought this. What's it called again? A dry robe. Yeah, a dry robe. And it came as a large, and I should have gotten a medium. Let me move the box. And it's just really to wear, like in the awning. Maybe now and again, I'd like to wear it out. No. I would. I'd wear this out. We were like at, not festival, but, <laughs> you know, if we were like doing something. Well, it's a large, and I really don't know. Dan's saying to just keep it. It's just to keep you warm in the awning. 
Yeah, and I that's know. exactly what it will do. It's just when you spend that sort of money, you want it to be the right size, don't you? So that's my new dry robe. Maybe I will keep it. If not, I'm going to get it sent back. Right, so what's what then, darling? I think we've decided we're just going to have a lazy day today. Oh, are we? Yeah, because I'm poorly. Yeah. And it's going to rain all day. Have we got any super duper thanks? Uh, Lynn and Tony. Thank you very much, Thank Lynn and Tony. Thank you, Lynn and Tony. <laughs> well, your super <laughs> thanks appreciated. <sighs> yeah, I don't know what we're going to do today. Oh, boring. Uh, I want to do something, <laughs> but what can you do, really, without making myself even more poorly? Yeah, I don't want to get poorly. I know JP wanted to go over to the, take a walk to the deer park and that, didn't he, and get some photo shots. He's not doing that today, then, is he? Or? He's just let's just have a lazy day so i don't know oh, okay big executive decision i'm keeping it <laughs> so if i cut that off then i've definitely got to keep it haven't i it is lovely and snug jp and sammy has one but they have the green ones there we go so that's it it's mine to keep now <laughs> How on earth I'm ever going to wash these? Right, so Dan's just taking trash over. He's now actually just emptying one of our toilet cassettes. He's not well, bless him. Just having a little chill day. But luckily for him, look, the toilet cassette empty and is only there. And I actually got up at half seven this morning, had a wonderful shower in that block today. The heads on them showers were massive. And the water was just so delicious and you don't have to keep pushing a button in it's a proper shower proper knobs you know you've got as much water as you want really nice and clean over there as well oh i must show you this a little update on a mazzy item that i made <laughs> now i bought this with me still knowing it looks pretty and i and you can't really see the detail on it oh <laughs> but look at it Oranges are gone, a rank, cones have fell off. <laughs> and I'm poor. But it still looks pretty at night. So what I might do, reconsider actually is bringing it home anyway. I'm still gonna use, I use it at night. I put fresh batteries in it. Bring it home and just redo it again. Keep it all wrapped up with the lights on there and stuff. So, but yep, still looks pretty at night. <sighs> all right, let's get in. In the warm, heating bang on, and just staying cozy. So as it's been raining lots, a little quick update on our skylight. Not actually been seeing any more drips. I mean, we did have one over here yesterday. Mm. Very far, very, very minute. But like I said, we do have the, like, the black coming around the outside. Maybe the water's seeping in, in between like, the skylight into the roof we don't know so removing it could either solve it or cause us more problems than need be so i don't really know what we're going to do about that i don't know maybe just leave it and wait and wait and totally see don't know <laughs> but i really don't want to be causing more trouble than what it's worth what just say goodbye to everybody oh is that it then? That's it, we're having a cosy day. Till tomorrow. Going out tomorrow though. Yeah, we're off to the supermarket. No, we're going to make a day of it and then pop to the supermarket. We certainly are, we're going to have another adventure tomorrow. Yeah. But all remember right now uh, to leave loads of comments in the uh, comments. Um, basically saying, hope you get better soon Dan. You're clearly poorly, and we're worried about you, and we love you. <laughs> because I'm poorly. You're such a worse. Say goodbye to everyone, because I'm, I'm too poorly to do it. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. Remember, Bye. I'm poorly. <laughs>